Hey everyone, welcome back to a new Wizard 101 video. Today is July 1st, which means that it's the next month that we get another jewel from the Kroger cards. I think they're expanding it to other stores too, so you just have to check on their Twitter or their blog to see what those stores actually are. None of them are really by me, so I've had to go through other people who were able to pick up the cards for me. So thank you to all of them that have been able to get me cards so far. But this is the next month's jewel. These jewels usually come with a Maycast talent and a normal, just regular pet talent. Like in the past, we've had just Power Pip Chance and... Do we have Accuracy? I'm not sure what the other ones were. Wait, I think I might have them in here somewhere. I hope I didn't delete them. I usually don't just go through. I should probably either lock them or put them someplace else. But oh yeah, I think one was Pain Giver. It was like the 3% damage. So... Maybe it wasn't Pain Giver. It might have been... Uh, it was Pain Bringer. But, yeah. Those were the other ones. Uh, here's one of them. Twist of Fate. That was Accuracy. So, there was a Accuracy one. But, those are some of the new ones. I've done videos on all of them so far up to this point. And now we have the next one for July. Which is in my gift box here. So, all these energy elixirs were from the past ones. I just haven't used them yet. But, Undauntable Opal. This is the new one and it gives resist and may cast brace. So this one is more of a war pet uh, jewel. So we're gonna go ahead and not redeem that because uh, yeah, max bag for those. Let me just delete this plus 10 mana. I wish I could say just never give me mana jewels. Like just automatically give me gold instead of mana jewels because I'm never going to want to use a jewel to increase my mana. Never gonna happen. Undauntable Opal, please let me redeem. Good. So let's take a look at it in here first. I'm going to definitely want to lock that. I recommend locking all these because these are super rare jewels and they're no shatter, but you can accidentally trash it or something like this. That. So that would be bad. But here it is. This is what it looks like, Undauntable. And if we go ahead, I guess we have to put it on a pet, right? So let me see what pets. I could put this on. I was thinking about putting it on my uh, pet Sasha here, which has make us healing current, make us fairy, some outgoing healing. It has 10% proof, and then there's a space. I don't need the accuracy anymore. I just put that on there because I had nothing else. But there's a space for it because the talent that it gives, well, it gives two talents make us brace. The other talent is defy. So you need to make sure your pet doesn't have defy in order to use this uh, where is it it's down here there it is plus five percent resist make us brace so if you were to create a pet that could use this new ward talent dual talent jewel you're gonna have to make sure that it doesn't that's the wrong pet you're gonna have to make sure that it doesn't have defy and this was my one of my only pets that didn't have defy right now so might as well put it on that toby does have defy and i had to socket a uh, spellproof jewel on him but i was thinking about putting it on him but then i'm like you know what what's the real point of doing that because he has may cast cycle of life so why would i want may cast cycle of life and may cast brace on the same pet that doesn't make any sense this jewel i could see people using on ward pets because a lot of ward pets already have may cast brace so this will just allow you to have that plus have defy which leaves an extra space for a different talent so it's helping to create better pets overall that can get, what is that, two, four, six, seven talents. That's a lot. <laughs> That's a lot of talents. So there it is, May Cast Brace. But I just wanted to let you guys know that this is the jewel for July. Once July has passed, you can't get this jewel again. Because even the same cards, if you redeem them later on in a different month, you won't be able to get that jewel. So I feel like this is one of the better jewels that we've seen so far. I don't know if I'm going to be using it. I was thinking about it, but... On my current pets, it doesn't really seem like I need it. If I look at Kobe, who's one of my other... I think he's this way. Kobe's one of my other pets, but he does have Defy on it. A lot of my pets already have it. And plus, I would have to remove his Fire Ward, so I don't really want to do that. If I were to use it, I'd have to completely make a new pet. Just for the pure fact of using this jewel. Just because I don't want to have Defy on it, and then I would have to make sure that none of them have it. Because if it gets Defy, it would be a fail, and I'll have to start over. But there it is. I'm not going to go ahead and test it because I'm sure it 
people know how Brace and the other auras are cast. Those are cast quite often. You can do basically anything and it would cast an aura. If you've seen any of my videos using Toby, he casts his aura all the time. And just passing can cause it to cast the, the May cast aura. So, May cast Brace is on this one. That's what it looks like. It's called Brace for Impact, which <laughs> that's kind of funny because that's, that's what uh, Pork says when you're going to Imperia. And then Spell Defying is the talent for it. So, there we go. This one's pretty good. I could see a lot of people using this on a ward pet. Maybe people already have pets that don't have Defy, and then you just socket this and you're done. There you go. You can shatter it too, so make sure you remember that. Oh yeah, there should be like a little aura on the pet. Let me, I didn't even see that. I kind of forgot about that. So there should be a little aura. Yeah, there you go. So, it's just that white aura because, I mean, I guess that's what they... Usually, there's different ones for each school. This is... I don't know which, one, which school this one would be. Universal? <laughs> I don't know. But, there you go. Yeah, I mean, it's probably universal, right? The other one was... If I had to categorize this one, I don't know, maybe ice? But the aura's not really, really blue. It's kind of just white. I don't know. So, there you go. That is July's jewel for this month. I will be back next month on the, the first to look at the next one. Because I don't know how many months in a row there's going to be jewels. But they're 20 bucks. They're kind of expensive. And you can only get them from certain areas. Take that as you will. I just want to let you guys know that it does exist in the game and if you see it that's where it's from so hope you guys enjoyed it if you did leave a like subscribe for more i'll see you all next time